Next guy up at number nine, we've got Matve. Is it Griden? Look at that. I think it's Gradine. I don't know. Gradine? Yeah, I have no idea. But uh, I got to hear more about this guy. He seems like a beauty. He is incredible. Leading the USHL in scoring right now. Again, Muskegon. Weird. Um, I think Bobby Mack had him at the end of his first round. And that he really, I mean, he was somewhat known as like a high offensive potential player this year coming in. He's just taken it to a new level this year where he like playmaking ability. He's got a phenomenal fucking shot. So dual threat offensively, and he's got good size. He skates really well. So you're talking about yet another player in this draft class with like all the intriguing tools um, in terms of players you can work with. Another Michigan kid. Um, he's coming into Michigan. Uh, but what he's doing this year in the USHL is like, I mean, he's torching like, 64 points in 48 games. He, again, like I said, dual threat offensively. He can be a dynamic playmaking forward. He can score goals himself. So the fact that he's able to create offense in a multitude of ways, I mean, again, the shot's no joke. It gives you some kind of two-way ability where he's not like a black hole defensively. So, um, again, Free Me definitely came on the radar. Real, I mean, like I knew who he was, knew he was eligible. I thought, you know, coming to the year, I thought of him maybe like a tail end of the second got, kind of guy, uh, maybe mid-round. But, like, what he is doing in Muskegon this year is phenomenal. Very fun player. Fucking, of course, is going to Michigan again. Um, and, again, I think Bobby Mack had him 32 on his list, if I remember correctly. Um, very intriguing player. Very intriguing. Again, six foot two skates well, dual threat offensively. You love those guys. 